Hello, everyone. My name is Zhao Chengyu. The title of my paper is the research and the design of a dimming control system based on STMR32. First is the abstract. The dimming control system with the high efficiency and energy saving, simple and convenient operation is of great significance to daily life and in structure production. This paper we use STM32 as a control core, designs a dimming control system based on PWM dimming mode and Bluetooth to send control commands. The experimental results show that the system can realize a small adjustment of the brightness of the four LEDs remotely. The keywords are STM32, light emitting diodes, plus with modulation. Then its background and significance with the rapid development of LED lighting technology, people's demand for professional lighting is also increasing. Compared with traditional lighting sources with single function, high energy consumption, long linear dimming and another shortcomings, LED has the advantages of high photoelectric conversion efficiency, low energy consumption, long life, fast response etc. And LED is easy to combine with a lot of technology, which can better meet people's lighting needs. Combined with the rapid response characteristic of LED, this paper used PWM dimming technology to design a LED dimming control system based on STM32 and use Bluetooth communication to realize the remote brightness control of LED. The main content of this paper can divide into the following four parts. The first part is the principle of PWM dimming. The second part is the overall design of dimming system. The second part is the design of dimming system. And the last part is experiments and results analysis. The first part is the principle of PWM dimming. The main content includes the basic principle of PWM and how the microcontroller works. The luminous intensity of the LED is proportional to the current flowing through it, so the brightness of the LED can be adjusted by controlling the current combined with the fast response characteristics of, P of LED. PWM dimming is used to make the switch circuit switch LED quickly at a center frequency that's to change the average circuit flowing through the LED to realize the switch and the brightness adjustment of LED. The basic principle of PWM dimming is showed in Figure 1. The pulse counter TMX CNT is set to count up, and the value of the auto reload register TMX AR is AR. As the clock sources keeps counting, the value CNT of the pulse counter TMS CNT will be compared with the present value CCIX of the compare register TMX CCIX. When CNT bigger than CCIX, output high electrical level, otherwise output low electrical level. Changing the value of CCIX can change the duty cycle of output PWM, and change the value of AR can change the period of the output of PWM. The timer period is AR, and the duty cycle of the output PWM way is CCIX uh, divided AR added 1. The second part is the overall design of dimming system. The main content includes the modules that make up the dimming system and the way to achieve LED dimming. This paper selects STM32 F103 VET6 as the main control chip, which is mainly composed of Bluetooth module, LED draw module, power module, and LED load, etc. The LED dimming control system is shown in Figure 2. Send control commands to the Bluetooth module through the mobile phone. The Bluetooth module communicates with STM32 uh, microcontroller through serial port. Control 
STM32 to output PWAs with different duty cycle and then, and then outputs PWAs to LED driver circuits to realize adjustment of LED brightness remotely. The third part is the design of the main system. The main content includes the hardware circuit and a software program design of the dimming system. The hardware circuit mainly includes the main control module, the peripheral circuit, the Bluetooth module, and the LED drive circuit. The software design is mainly the concrete realization of the LED dimming function. In this paper, the peripheral circuit mainly includes reset circuit, crystal oscillate circuit, power spot circuit, etc. The reset circuit makes the whole system return to the initial state. The crystal oscillate circuit provides accurate clock signal for the dimming system, and the power spot circuit supports power for the whole system. The Bluetooth module chose HC05. It's connected to the microcontroller through four pins. RXD and TXD are respectively connected to the TXD and RXD pins on the microcontroller to receive and send data. The reset circuit is made up of resistance and electrical capacity. The system is showed in figure 3. At the moment, the system is powered on. Uh, the voltage across the capacitor cannot, ch cannot change suddenly. At this time, the input voltage to the NIST pin is low, and the system is reset. Then the powered on voltage VCC charge the capacitor uh, through the resistor, and the voltage across the capacitor continues to raise. At this time, the high, le the high uh, voltage level is input to the NIST pin, and the system works normally. STM32 mainly has two oscillation modes in order to improve the clock persist. HC is selected as a more clock sources. Figure 4 shows the crystal oscillator circuits. The selection of a capacitor C1 and C2 must be compatible with the circuit. By calculation, when C1 and C2 were 22, it can be meet requirement, and the system is working properly. Figure 6 is the main program flow chart. The main program judges the data transmitted by Bluetooth through the Y1 loop and uses the status receiving flag N to judge whether the data transmission is completed. For the output PWV of channel 1, send a value of 0. After the Bluetooth module successful receives the date through the serial port, the date is stored in the array USART BUF. The output PWV duty cycle increased by 1%, and the value 1 will be returned. When increased to 100%, continue to send the value 0. Its duty cycle remains unchanged, and uh, at this time, the duty cycle has been adjusted to the maximum. The other three PWM output procedures are similar. Writing the program like this way is easy to control the duty cycle of each output PWV, and we can change the stamp length of each increased or decreased of the duty cycle to achieve more convenient or precise brightness control of each LED, and the return view can be very easy shows whether the data transmitted by Bluetooth is successful, received, or whether the duty cycle has been adjusted to the upper or lower limits. The last part is experiment and results analysis. 
observe the dimming effect through experiment and uh, analyze the result. According to the above software and hardware design, the dimming control system is completed as shown in Figure 7. In order to ensure the stability of the system, the power spot outputs 3.6 voltage and the LED brightness can be kept stable. The mobile phone is connected to the Bluetooth module and the blue indicator light of the Bluetooth module flash double after successful pairing. The four LED drivers in parallel through the Bluetooth serial port. Uh, assistant of the mobile phone sets the duty cycle of the four output PWAs to 10%, 40%, 70%, and 100% respectively, and uh, observe with a oscilloscope. Observe with an oscilloscope. The output waveforms are shown in figure 8 and figure 9. The dimming effect of each LED at different duty cycles is shown in figure 10. The four LEDs input PWA duty cycles from top to bottom are 10%, 40%, 70%, and 100%. From the above experiments, the LED dimming system controls the output of a stable voltage and current, and a small brightness adjustment of the four LEDs can be achieved. Through the Bluetooth control of the mobile phone, which meets the design requirement of the dimming system, through the experimental results, LED brightness changed smoothly. When the PWM single input is 100%, the LED should not be on for a long time. It might be damaged if the temperature rises after lighting for a long time. With the deep integration of LED lighting technology and the international of sense technology, its applications in the lighting field are becoming wilder and wilder. And uh, at the same time, it can better meet people's lighting requirements. This paper selects STM32 F103 VET6 as a main control chip, combined with Bluetooth wireless communication, and achieve brightness control of the four LEDs remotely. Through software design, 1000 level dimming of output PWM of microcontroller is realized that it can control the input current value of each LED more precisely. It can be seen from the experimental results that the system can smoothly adjust the brightness of the four LEDs to meet the requirements. The system has simple structure and convenient control, with, which provides a reference for the research and the design of LED wireless uh, control system. The system also has a lot to improve. For example, when more LEDs need to be controlled, LED welding will be a problem. At the same time, heat dissipation should be conserved. When a large number of LEDs are connected in parallel, the drive power supply of the system also needs to foster on whether the output current meets the requirements. When more LEDs need to be controlled, all LEDs can be soldered on uh, aluminum based circuit board, and then the heat conducting silica gel is connected to the aluminum radiator. Finally, active cooling with fan uh, can effectively dissipate heat, and the current can be uh, insufficient. We can consider the use of uh, serial and parallel hybrid way to connect the LED. 
This is a reference of uh, this paper. That is all. Thank you.